it together always. If one day you had a heart. Why did you come? Deceptive twaddle speaks as I. If you have a better alternative, please share. Cuttlefish. I. Let us not, dear friends, forget our dear friends, the cuttlefish. Flip a glorious little sausages. Then I'm up together and they will devour each other without a second thought. Human nature, isn't it? Or fish nature. So, yes, we could hold up here, well provisioned and well armed, and half of us would be dead within the month. Which seems quite grim to me, any way you slice it. Ah. As my learned colleague so naively suggests, we can release Calypso. And we can pray that she will be merciful. I rather doubt it. Can we, in fact, pretend that she is anything other than a woman scorned like which fury hell hath no? We cannot. Res ipsa loquita tabula in the fratio. We are left with but one option. I agree with, and I cannot believe the words are coming out of my mouth. Captain Swan, we must fight. You've always run away from a fight. Have not. You have so. Have not. You have so. Have not. You have so, and you know it. Have not, Slender and Callum. I have only ever embraced that oldest and noblest of pirate traditions. I submit that here now, that is what we all must do. We must fight to run away. I. As per the code, an act of war, and this be exactly that, can only be declared by the Pirate King. You made that up. Did I now? I call on Captain Teague, Keeper of the Code. Code is the law. Morgan and Bartholomew. 
shall be the duties of the kingdom. Well, all I wish I had, sir, is Fancy that? 